<laughs> Being able to make a big sound from a big instrument is a blast. <laughs> and that's the thing, music is really fun. Yeah. And that's the best way to learn is when you're having fun. Welcome to the Instrument Zoo, one of the North Carolina Symphony's education outreach programs. And I teach everybody how to buzz their lips. Can you make a horsey sound? And then you make your lips a little bit tighter and you go. And then buzz the mouthpiece. The symphony is the nation's first to receive continuous public funding. With that investment came a mandate to educate. So since the 1940s, the symphony has been bringing music to children all across the state. We serve over 50,000 students annually through our education concerts. Um, and the first concert in, was in 1946. And since then, we have served more than 4 million students statewide throughout North Carolina. So wow. it's really amazing. <laughs> and what else is amazing? Dozens of young children all behaving themselves and waiting patiently just for a chance to get their hands on those instruments. Um, I never played a horn, but this was like my first time actually playing it and inspiring me. You did really well. Thank you. Was it was it funny? I mean, did it feel funny when you're blowing in there? Yeah, because it's like your lips were like going in, like like you're chewing something, and like you're like squeezing into it. <laughs> I never played it before. So how did you have to play it? What did you do with your mouth to make you play it? I kind of make a horse sound like this, like that. And then you went right into that mouthpiece, right? Uh huh. Then what did you have to do with your arm? I had to, I had to slide the, I had to slide the thing, like, slide it with the front one, like, and she was helping me with the, all the way to the top. Why do you like music so much? Uh, because it makes noise. <laughs> and making noise is fun, isn't it? Yep, and you get to dance. Can you dance for me? Uh-huh. Let me see it. And not only is this fun, researchers say music makes your brain fit as a fiddle. Studies show math skills increase after learning music because music is math. Rhythm is divided into fractions like 16th notes or three-quarter time. So there's all kinds of studies about cognitive effects of actually picking up an instrument as opposed to a wee stick or a joystick or just messing around on your computer. It's something that you learn to do that helps your brain for the rest of your life no matter what you're doing. Music also is its own special language and experts say playing an instrument develops hand dexterity. Music advocates have a new twist on the push for more STEM education. They want that changed to STEAM. Just add an A in there for the arts um, because the role that the arts can play Within, within STEM, within all of those areas, is just really amazing. <laughs> Actually, my grandma played the clarinet growing up, and so she had an old clarinet and an old trumpet in, in her house. And um, I found them one day and was instantly attracted to them and just had to try playing them, and it really change the course of my life. So the goal of the instrument zoo is that as these children make big sounds with big instruments, they'll have fun, they'll develop their brains, and they'll become inspired by music. And who knows, maybe some of these students will find their way from this to this. You 
Learn how to do something by yourself without anybody doing it for you. Kids have to learn how to um, figure it out. They have to figure it out. They have to pick it up and figure it out. And if you practice, then you get better at it. And then that's a reward in itself. Having that opportunity to really have a chance to have their hands on an instrument and produce the sound to create something from nothing is, is really inspirational for them. Why do you like music so much? Um, because like, you get inspired your feelings and how you like really love instruments and um, so it's like really fun doing things that you like. It's fun to make music, isn't it? Yes. <laughs>